Hey guys, Roman Super Saiyan here, back again with another episode of Vainglory. And this time I'm doing Weapon Power Adagio. Uh, there's been an update from him, as you guys have known. <clears throat> so I wanted to see if he's still viable as a Weapon Power dealer. Uh, let's go ahead and go to... <sighs> I'm not going to be Lane. I chose Lane, and of course, you always get those people. Michael Jack. Uh, who decides to go Lane with you. After you've already, like, you've waited... To make sure everybody's gonna like choose appropriate heroes, he chose Vox. I was like, okay, he can go jungle, that's fine. So I locked in as lane, and then he switched to lane. I was like, oh, are you serious? <laughs> so <coughs> I don't know <coughs> what's gonna happen there. Hopefully, it's not too bad. Right, let's go ahead and go. There we go. Not too bad. Good start. Gotta be careful here. I'll go easy. Throw out heals for my team. Fight. There we go. Nice. You're impressive. This is not going good for them. Get it, get it. Sure. No time like the All right, go in the lane. Yeah, buddy. That range. Dodge's range is OP. Unlike me, you are entitled. Walk ahead of me. Sweetness. Yeah, the box is working with me, so that's good. That's what I like to see. Why not? Mining has begun. Gonna go to lane. Or not lane. Uh, jungle, so I can get to the shop and then buy some items here. I'm probably gonna go towards a tornado trigger first. Uh, I'll go to tension bow. Uh, the reason why is because Celeste is pretty low in overall health pool. Uh, so, it might be uh, a smart idea for me to kind of build that way. <coughs> Alright. Perhaps this is best. Fox, please, get out, please. Drifting on the Halcyon. 
Can you jump? There it is. Nice. All right. Uh, let's go back out the lane. <coughs> Not bad at all. Is this the hotness? I'm not sure. Beautiful things deserve to be changed. We'll back at like at 900 because I want to get that second item into the tension bow, which is 600 gold plus the boots. Taka's in trouble. Let's go down and see if we can maybe check them a bit. You're dead, son. Last got away, though. You are getting ridiculous. All right, we got our boots. Oh, we need uh, a little bit more, actually. Oof. That was close. All according to my plan. Enemy hero kill. Good job, team. Good job. I'm gonna go back. There we go. Oh, uh, keep building into our Swift Reader as well. Uh, our, uh, Walk ahead of not Swift Reader, the Tornado Trigger. <coughs> All right. The next time we kill somebody, we need to seriously think about getting the. Gold mine. Oh, uh, you survive. Oh, whoops. Walk <laughs> ahead of me. Unlike me. Ally hero killed. Woo. Possibly Too close no. for comfort. All right, yes. Actually, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to sit back. <laughs> I was distracted watching you fly. Very nice. Time to end you. Doing some damage. Nice. Help back up. <clears throat> Very nice. Sometimes you have to be yourself. All according to my Oh, yeah.
Bam. You are kind of a big deal. Why not? I'll go easy on you. Burn it down. <clears throat> Immense gold payout collected. Alright, I'm gonna go and get my tension bow. Uh, just gonna get another salvo for now. Just gonna get potions galore, since I don't get energy battery as a weapon power uh, dealer. There it is. So squishy. Dang it. <clears throat> he blocked me. Sure. No time like the present. Let's go ahead and probably get this was shooter. Get into that uh, what's the item called? Lucky strike. And then finally the corner trigger. Tornado trigger. Unlike And turret is probably going down. Go ahead and heal this guy. Oh, you know, he's going back. <clears throat> Give him a heal of Taka then. He's still around. Let's go ahead and take this guy down. I'll go easy on Lucky strike, so 700. Need about 250 more. <clears throat> Get about a thousand gold. Sometimes you have to do it yourself. Perhaps this is best. There's my goal I needed. At this point, I really don't care <clears throat> if people come up and take my farm. It's a team game at this point, like a, a team fight game, so gold farm is whoever can grab it first. So I'm not really making a big deal by him coming up and just taking farm. Uh, cause a lot of times they can clear, clear jungle a lot faster too, and it's not like they're doing like, things that are useless. They're actually like doing quite well. So, like me... Hold on, hold on. There it is. Enemy hero killed. Ally is kind of a big deal. Aced. Alright, let's go ahead and build into my next uh, tornado trigger. <clears throat> so I need 1600 gold and then I'm good. I'll hold that. There 
go. Almost there. Six hundred gold. They backed up. They're just like scared. We get a couple flares. Or not a couple. One. Oh, they surrendered. <laughs> yeah, it's game. <clears throat> Didn't get a full match going. Whew, yeah, we just like decimated them. So seven zero ten flawless. Uh, it just was not good from the get-go. Like, I am the hotness, and I don't know why they did so bad. I guess they just really had a bad start. They didn't have good team play. I was actually worried because we had really squishy people in our team. Vox, which is pretty squishy, uh, Taka, and myself. Although Vox and Taka have, like, things to avoid damage. Whereas myself, I'm really vulnerable, especially when I don't have any kind of tank to stun or knock people away from me. But I manage because I do have that slow, and uh, it really helps against Cruel especially because you can kind of kite him, burn down his little barrier, and then eventually burn down his health with the help of your teammates. Uh, Warrior Goddess and Celeste just had a hard time because she was so squishy. What was she building? Uh, she had a frost burn first. I don't know if that was the best idea. I think if it was me, I would have gone to straight CP in the beginning because frost burn isn't that big of a deal yet. Um, especially with Vox and Taku who have high mobility anyways uh, that frost burn isn't as effective on them um, whereas if you're going against an Adagio or say like a Glaive or maybe like a Cruel frost burn may have been a okay choice but I, I always go like straight CP first I feel with Celeste just because it's better that way uh, you want to be able to whip out that damage fast because you're going to die fast if you don't if you don't kill anybody um Cruel had a very interesting build. He went like defensive at first, it seems, which mm, it was an okay decision. And he was going armor for me apparently. <laughs> uh, and then he probably, he probably should have gone like maybe a uh, maybe he was going shift too. I don't know, but he just had a rough time. I think maybe if he went like possibly an aftershock first. They can burst some faster and just be a little bit more like assassin y, if that's even a word, uh, than being like this upfront brute. He seems like he was always like in the in our face, but never like ganking us. He didn't come to lane very often at all, if I remember, maybe once. And that's like really where he shines is for the ganks nowadays. And Vox, Vox with Eve of Harvest first. I don't know if I approve. Uh, I generally go like a attack speed, like maybe an alternate current like our Vox, or possibly a um, a just like a straight crystal or uh, shatter glass, because the damage is just really nice. And then you kind of build the even harvest or the alternate current afterwards if you didn't build it first. Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed uh, me playing weapon power at Daijo. Didn't do much. Got the double tornado trigger and the tension bow. What I would have gotten is obviously finish off my boots, so that's four items. Uh, maybe gotten a counter build item, so that'd be five. And then the final item obviously would have been a Sorrow Blade for that chunk of damage that I could do. Uh, but you guys kind of saw the mechanics of how he plays. You use that tension bow to get high burst uh, on the weak targets like Celeste or Vox. And then you go ahead and use your Trinity Triggers. For that attack speed and that, that little bit of crit and a little bit of crit damage. I think it's like 20% each. So I got 40% each, which is not too bad. Um, even without the attack speed boost that he had prior, he's still like a pretty strong as long as you can play him accordingly. I have no problems with him. The dual tw tornado trigger kind of solves that problem for me. Um, and I can still manage to stay alive as long as my teammates are good too. 18-3, uh, not too bad. And I'll see you guys next time. Later!